see what is known about the actor's hospitalization and current health status for Jamie Foxx. After hearing rumors that the family had prepared for the worst, the actor's daughter, Kareen Foxx, wrote on Friday that he had been discharged from the hospital weeks ago. After several months of no updates on the actor Jamie Foxx's health, who was admitted to the hospital in early April, his daughter Kareen said on Friday that he had been released weeks ago. The young woman's post was in response to speculations that the family of the Oscar winner for Ray was prepared for the worst, which were reported by American tabloids and blogs. The precise cause is yet unknown. Kareen only disclosed the actor's recovery on April 12 after he had experienced a medical complication the day before. The hospitalization was first reported on the TMZ website, but there were no further details provided. He is now fortunately well on the road to recovery thanks to prompt action and excellent care. We are grateful for your prayers and are aware of how much he is adored. During this moment, the family requests privacy, the young woman posted on Instagram. Yet another thing that was never explained. The actor's family and the actor himself have not provided any updates on what transpired since the hospitalization. On the final day three, Jamie at most posted a gratitude for the support. I appreciate all the love, I'm grateful, he wrote. Even in early May, TMZ reported that the actor was still in the hospital. Kareen now disputes the information, claiming that he left the hospital weeks ago. Not at all, the daughter claims. According to Kareen, her father was discharged from the hospital weeks ago and was even able to play pick the ball on Thursday. In interviews, a few of Jamie's co-workers and acquaintances have stated that the actor is okay. I've heard he's improving. One of the best we have in Hollywood, I pray for him every night, and I wish him the best, comedian Martin Lawrence told Extra. The actor was doing well, according to comedian Tiffany Haddish, who told the website of Entertainment Tonight that she was being kept informed by their common pals. On the Logan Paul podcast, comedian Kevin Hart remarked, As far as I'm concerned, there's a lot of progression and a lot of improvement. Jamie was working on the set of the Cameron Diaz and Glenn Close movie back in action at the time of the event. According to People magazine, the complication did not occur in the studio, and while some recording days had to be cancelled, others have since been kept open. Jamie had to be replaced as the host of the music program Beat Shazam in addition to the movie. Nick Cannon took over the role on day three. The DJ for the show, Kareen, also departed to take part.